This is James with WSTrades.com. I want to provide an update here on ticker ADTX. So this thing really blasted off today. We started to see some volume yesterday. Pretty good little pump, but today was really insane. So you can see this thing was down around the $10 level here on the 15 minute before it ripped all the way in after hours up to almost $84. So insane explosion here. So I'm like, okay, this is ridiculous. This looks like so just some regular, you know, pump and dump action. Um, you know, up 461% on the day. So I came in and I started to look at their financials, and uh, as suspected, their financials are not good. Uh, They're really ugly. So if you look at the profitability section here in Yahoo Finance, the operating margin in the last 12 months is negative 2,432%. That's one of the worst I've seen. Uh, return on assets the last 12 months, negative 159%. That's really bad as well. Um, we've got EBITDA, negative 22.61 million, not good. Uh, diluted EPS the last 12 months, $198 in the negative. That's pretty brutal. <clears throat> and this is pretty bad here too. If you look at the most recent quarter, supposedly they're only sitting on 95,000 in cash. And if you look at the cash flow part here, in the last 12 months, they supposedly burned 11.55 million. So let's go take a look here at the financials tab. Let's take a look here at the income statement. So on the annual or the year over year, net income common stockholders is negative every year and it's growing. Look at uh, 2019, they lost $5.8 million and the last 12 months they've lost $43 million for earnings. So that is completely pathetic. <clears throat> Operating cash flow growing in the wrong direction. So you can see it's just negative across the board, but increasing the last 12 months, uh, they've lost 24.3 million in operations. And then if you look at the free cash flow, um, that's going in the wrong direction as well, just like the operating cash flow. And you can see negative 24.7 million there. So let's look at the quarterly real quick um, to see that. Yeah, so that in cash position is 95,000 and they burned through 24.7 million uh, in the last 12 months in free cash flow. So um, yeah, that's not good. I saw their current ratio on the statistics tab was also 0.22, which is really, really low. Uh, so kind of what I'm looking here, I'm kind of bummed that I found this after hours, to be honest, because if I would have saw this during you know, regular trading hours, I definitely would have shorted this thing, like sold it in the money call spread or sold it in the money call, like something, um, because this is totally just pump and dump uh, price action. You can see they went from like 68 down to like 28 within the same day. So like massive pump, insane dump, another pump, started to dump again in after hours. But um, yeah, I'll take a look at it and I'll kind of see where it's positioned, uh, you know, come tomorrow. Uh, once the market opens, I would love to see it rally and just get one more good pump and retest that high there of like 83, 84. I think that would be a great position to get in at. Um, and then if you could short it, you know, around that level, you know, look for an insane 20, 30, $40 move like we saw here. I mean, it could happen same day. Uh, but, you know, we kind of seen starting to sell off again here, but we kind of seen similar price action with VFS. That was another company that just terrible financials but it just blasted off to the moon. And if you check my community posts on the channel, you'll see I made out with a ton of money uh, shorting that thing. So this honestly is looking like another possible opportunity similar to BFS, but I'll keep you updated here on ticker ADTX. Please like this video. Please also subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. Hit that notification bell. Appreciate you for taking the time to watch this. Talk to you soon.